Well, good afternoon. It is uh, the 19th of January at 12.05 p.m. Eastern Time. My team, right here, we're playing Kansas City Sunday, and we're going to beat them, and we're going to go to the big dance. I have confidence. I'm coming to you today. Uh, I had a dream. Sorry if I'm moving the camera around. I had a dream. I think it was two nights ago that I saw an old-fashioned rotary telephone sitting on a pedestal table. And this phone was gold, a gold phone. And I couldn't really understand what the meaning of it meant. But then I heard in my spirit about a song that when I went to my very first church, when I got saved, I sang a song, if you confess the Lord, call him up and tell him what you want. So I thought about it all day and it made sense. There was another part of that dream that I'm not even going to get into because it was so weird it made absolutely no sense. And then yesterday, last night, this morning, I had another dream. I was with a much older man, but I never saw him. He said to his servants, give Nancy whatever she wants. I went to New York City and I was in um, the Waldorf Astoria in the penthouse, presidential suite, whatever you call it. And all I heard was give Nancy whatever she wants Give her the credit card with unlimited money. I can go get whatever I want. So the driver of the car service, I said, I want to go to the Louis Vuitton store. And he took me to the Louis Vuitton store. I said, I'll be out in a few minutes. And he waited in the car for me. I bought two purses and I came out. And then I remember going to another place to get a new pair of glasses because I, I wear glasses. I have lineless bifocals. And I was sitting there watching a movie and I was talking with someone that was there. I don't remember who it was. But it was like I was so happy and excited. You know, I said, I have a man in my life who loves me very much. And gave me a credit card with unlimited credit. I, for infinity, I could buy whatever I want. And all I know is this man is Jesus Christ. He gave me the soul desires of my heart. With this house that we bought. And I hold on to the dreams. And I hope this video encourages you. If you confess the Lord, call him up. And tell him what you want. Can't stop praising his name. I think Hezekiah Walker sings that song. Or Richard Smallwood. I'm going to look it up. But be encouraged today. The word is be encouraged for today. And it's like Joyce Meyer said. Something good is going to happen to me today. But also something good is going to happen through me today. Because in the mornings when I get up, I put on Grace Unlimited or Grace Unmerited. It's on YouTube. It plays an hour of um, pastors preaching from different sermons and everything. And Joyce Meyer said that this morning and it stuck to me. Something good is going to happen to me today. Something good is going to happen through me today. So that's a word of encouragement for all of you today that are going through stuff. Call the Lord, confess the Lord, call him up and tell him what you want. He'll answer you. Because the only thing that kept coming to me was pick up the phone and call him 24-7. He's always there. He always answers. He never puts you on hold. We're too busy. Call back. No. You call on the name of the Lord today. And he will come to you and give you the soul desires of your heart. And I pray... That everybody that was in this storm on the East Coast, that you will be 
Oh, there's my Mickey Mouse ears. Yes, because I um, I'm a Disney fan. I love Disney. There's Mickey and Minnie. Anyways, call on the name of the Lord, and He'll answer you. And just know something good is going to happen to you today. Something good is going to happen through you today. Hold on to that. Go Bills! Woo! Have a great day.